In this video, we're going to work with random responses. And the random responses are, can be particularly useful when you have a bot running on a website with a lot of returning visitors. I mean, let's face it, if you come onto a website and there is a bot uh, running that continuously has the same conversation, then you might, no, you not might, it, it's quite sure that you will be bored or maybe even annoyed by it. Uh, that is why we have incorporated the feature called random responses and with that the bot replies to input uh, in, a, in a random uh, way uh, so that uh, when people uh, talk to it uh, multiple times the conversation does not become boring. The way you set it up it's actually very very easy. So in this case the first question of the conversation is a multiple choice question in which the bot introduces itself and asks whether the user is ready to start. Now, there are three options here, being yes, no, and maybe, and to those uh, response, uh, to those answer options, you can um, create responses. So if there is only one, uh, when somebody selects yes, the bot will always answer nice. And when somebody selects no, the bot will always, in this case, exit, and will always say, I will quickly leave you alone then. But as said, if you are looking to make the conversation uh, more human, then random responses might become useful. Uh, in that case, um, the bot will just reply randomly with the items that you put in. So there are two buttons uh, that you can uh, click on when uh, creating bot responses. Uh, one is uh, to add a, a chat text at all. So in this case, when somebody selects yes, the bot says nice. Um, and then, for example, says, let's proceed. But in this case, the reply will always be the same. If you click the blue button saying add random response, then the bot will select uh, these answers at random. So the one time it will say, nice, let's proceed. Uh, and the second time or the other time, it will say, okay, let's go. So let's save this one. And let's try it. But as said, there's no division in it. It's completely at random. So uh, I'm going to start the conversation now. And then let's say start. Ready to start. Then I say yes. Well, in this case, the bot replies with, OK, let's go. But if I refresh it, I click start again. And in this case, I say yes. It might again say, OK, let's go. But at random, it will also select the other option. So let's hope that at random, it does so right now. I say yes, and then it says nice. Let's proceed.